Hello and good morning. Welcome to your daily readings or day reading, not readings, reading on Monday the 9th of September. My name is Hemp from Self Love Self Care System and I'm going to be doing our daily readings in the Midnight Magic Tarot Deck of Mushrooms. I didn't get them out, I know I have them out ready, but I actually forgot. So I'll do that right now. So right, without further ado, I hope everyone's had a lovely weekend. And let's see what we're going to get for our three cards for today, on Monday, the 9th of September. Now, we get the energy of the day card, don't we? We get a problem if there is one. Which is going to take forever. <laughs> These ones are so new that they just really struggle to throw them out. And we're going to get a solution. Last time I said that to you, though, they threw it out. Didn't they? Actually, they, they threw it out too many there. No angels, I have to do it again. If it's four, I can't really do them. I can do... I can do two, but not, not four, not four cards. There we go, that's the one they want for the solution for the problem. Let's have a look and see what we've got. I've got the book out today. So if there's anything that we want clarified, I can look in the book. I don't normally do that for these readings, but sometimes I get a little bit called. It depends on what card we get. So it's kind of quite interesting to see what's in here because I never use this book. So it might be intriguing. Now let's have a look. Okay, right, so let's see what our energy for today, for Monday the 9th of September is. Okay. Oh, so we've got the three of pentacles. And the angels want me to they do want me to read it out of the book. Okay, let's 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 go with what they want to do. Let's let's do that. I wouldn't like I said I wouldn't normally do it, but let's let's do it. Like they they if they say I I like to listen to them because they're so cute. I don't always listen to them. But you've got to know this as as much as anyone else. I don't normally I often don't listen to them because Sometimes they have crazy ideas. Okay, so it's a number three. Let's see what we've got. Are you ready? Okay, I'm just going to hold it. And it'd be quite interesting because I think, I think I know why they want me to read this out to you because this is the Green Elf Cup, okay? And it's the Three of Pentacles. And the reason they want me to read it out, and now I know what it is, I don't know anything about mushrooms. They want you to hear this stuff about the mushrooms. So I'm going to read it here. The colour from Green Elf Cups stains grey brown decaying wood into a beautiful shade of turquoise with different elements as if assembled by the hand of a skilled craftsperson uniting them harmonize like a work of art a perfect match for the three of pentacles which emphasizes teamwork you know i always say this about teamwork but let's see what the card says and i'm going to go a little bit more into it it's about teamwork, collaboration and apprenticeship, it says here. Everyone has an important role to play in the construction of an important, possibly monumental task. Recognise and respect the value of skill levels and expertise. Right, they're talking about an apprenticeship or something like that. I mean, I'm not quite thinking that's the energy of the day. That's not the energy of the day. But I wanted to read it to you because the angel said there's some message in the mushroom information for you so if anyone's thinking of herbs or herbology or something to do with tinctures or they're also showing me um homeopathy they're showing me aromatherapy they're showing me things like that so if any of you are thinking of studying that because this card did talk about teamwork and apprenticeships right or some kind of collaboration and you can teamwork in a sort of a learning setting so i'm kind of getting that but today's energy actually is about the the connection to others and it's about connecting in and it's also got some kind of the angels are showing me they're showing me shiny things so they're saying it's it's got a vibration that's linked they're making me laugh that's linked to money to some degree but but it's shiny stuff it's like necklace you know like jewelry or there's something shiny in today so maybe you're going to buy something for yourself or something gets delivered that you've ordered or yeah, I mean, listen to the things that the this card said, because that's what they wanted you to have today. And is there anything else I want to say, angels? Oh, yes, I want to say, look after your throat. There's something to do with time and your throat, okay? Because although that's the three of pentacles there, I didn't, I saw a clock. There's something to do with time and your throat. And the angels are telling me there's a time. Oh, I got it, I got it. There's a time to speak up and there's a time to stay silent. That's what they're talking about. Yes, yeah. let's see there's a problem for today. The fool. Now, I'm not really seeing a problem here. What? You seriously don't want me to read this one out as well, do you? 
I don't normally read these cards out. They really want me to guys i'm just going to do it for you i'm just going to go with this because if this is what they want this is what i'm going to do okay it's called chicken at the woods and it's the full card and the full cards are normally about playing the fool or some kind of celebratory thing it's, it's kind of like that but let's see what this card actually says i'm really surprised they're making me do this I've, I've never done this in these readings before but like i say i think i have done it once and it probably was with these quite weird i think the angels have a lot to say and they want they, they they think this book's got a lot to say i mean not they've got a lot to say maybe they're tired today okay chicken of the woods is one of the easiest mushrooms for beginner foragers to identify and is therefore a good representation of the young and innocent fool its bright orange and yellow hues stick out like a beacon in early summer um, i lost it now versatile in its color and color i can't say that word culinary applications from sandwiches to soups and generous in its medicinal value this mushroom will offer the burgeoning forager a solid springboard to start their journey of becoming a mystical mycologist mycologist what's a mycologist is it like a mushroom person yeah this is mycologist i never heard of that before there is definitely some message for someone here that wants to do something to do with mushrooms or herbs or something like that because they like i say i don't normally i really don't normally do this as i've said to you before the zero creates a new beginning there's a new beginning coming out with this card right it's also a sense of independence with this card let's see what it says here it says you've discovered a new pa passion so nurture your childlike wonder of confidence as you dive deep into it go experience the world for yourself even if it's a dreary day you're going to become the powerhouse you know yourself to be and you're going to use hard work and a keen eye the only thing stopping you sorry yeah the only thing stopping you is you you've got this you've got this it's beautiful i love that i love that it's really really good i like that that was the message you were meant to get today really really lovely yeah they didn't want me to read the card they wanted me to read the messages i do get it i don't see a problem in this at all and i feel that you're going to feel supercharged and super earthed as you move forward because you've got this passion that's about to come up and the one thing i want to say here is we've got the moon here now it is the 9th of september however or in next week uh, i think it's on the 17th so yeah so 9 10 11, 12 13 14 15 16. so ne early next week we've got the full moon right on the full moon there's something passionate that you need to do now I'm going to be really honest, and I do want to say it because it's coming through. For some of you, you're not doing it, or you want to do it, but you're still not doing it. Ah, oh, I've got it. I know what it is. The angels have shown me. There's something, there's a pressure that's been put on you, or a burden that's been put on you, that is stopping you. And the angels are telling me to tell you, no, just get on with what you're meant to be doing, and do not worry about anything else. It's important that you do the thing. Okay? hope that makes sense. Right, let's see if I'm going to, this is a bonus card, remember. So we've got the, they, oh my goodness, they're driving me mad. They're going, please read the card. I was like, oh my God. I'm not going to read this one, guys. This one's the purple Lacuria, Knight of Cups. It's a gorgeous card. After this one. And after this one. Okay. And to do with the passions and this energy, the angels are supporting you in your journey to something new. Your passions are very spiritual. The new thing that you're going towards, this Eight of Cups, is very spiritual. But not only is it spiritual, it's also, sorry, not Eight of Cups, Knight of Cups. Do you know, backwards to my eyes, that looked like eight. I don't know. Honestly, dyslexia and dyscalculus makes you like see everything in a weird way. Um, but so this knight is bringing you that real strong connection into your spiritual source your spiritual energy your third eye i've got the third eye pulsating here for so for many of you and i'm also being told by the angels that your guardian angel is literally on top of you with this now you're going to be receiving a lot of feathers you're going to be receiving a lot of energy and vibration to help you with this but the other thing they're saying as well if you look here that looks like a snail going there i think it is actually a snail you're being asked to take this slowly take your creativity and your project and your new beginning slowly so that when it is right and it makes sense it becomes much more does that make sense i hope that makes sense because right now your passion is um almost like a hobby but it is going to go somewhere deeper than that and i hope that makes sense to all of you i'm so it was so weird doing the reading today different way so that is your readings for monday 
everybody have a beautiful beautiful day please do do give me a thumbs up if you got this far i kind of really appreciate them and it's so nice to get them it really is it's really funny on youtube asking for these things but it's kind of to do with the algorithms and how they work and so but if you did get this far and you've enjoyed it and you've got something even if it's just a little nugget from it or even just listening to my voice or something then please do give me one i'd really appreciate it also if you haven't subscribed and you do feel cool please do hit the subscribe bell it's on one of these sites and i never know which one it is um there are going to be a couple of videos for you to check out do check out the um angel message from saturday i watched it again and i really liked it so i hope it'd be like for something for you too because these angel messages if you have um the time revisit them because i feel there's something more in them every time you go back because i watched one of the, i watched the first one the other day and i got something from it that i hadn't got previously so as i say, i'll put it up here so you'll have the you'll have fridays uh week uh, sorry daily reading to check out if you need to so you can bring it all in together and you'll also have the angel reading everybody take care namaste have the most beautiful beautiful day and i will see you tomorrow lots of love kisses and love